Welcome back to Fix It Mac. Today we're working on an adjustable threshold and this screw right here will not raise up. It's leaving a uh, gap between the threshold and the weather stripping on the door and it makes a beautiful whistling sound. So what we're going to do is we're going to fix it. First thing we need, screwdriver, which we're going to use to raise up all these screws and lift that whole threshold up and then I use these nail setters. Um, this worked out really well if you have something like this or something that has um, a side, like something on each side so that you can set that ring back into the guide there on the screw. Um, this worked out well. And then you need a hammer. And we use that hammer and we hit the back of the nail setters and it pop that washer back up on the screw. So here we go, let's do it. So we'll just back it out. And we unscrew all these to get them as high as we possibly can to where they come out of the screw loops at the bottom. Okay, so as you back these out, they'll come out of their screw holes. sits that guy in there. Okay, so now, now that we've got this up, you can see that these rings sit on these screws. Now this is what's holding that piece of wood, making it go up and down. This one we had is, is loose, and it was not working. Um, so, what you probably need is these hole punches, or something similar to it, something that we can put on each side of this and you're probably going to need an extra hand, so I'll bring in my helper. Simply hit that with the hammer, and it's going to push that back onto the back onto the screw. So now that this is sitting back on the guide there, you can see that that screw is not going anywhere. So once you get that back on, which sometimes can be difficult, like I said, you need probably two people or four hands, one of the two. So back it up, knock it on there. You'll see that it's got these little guides that this ring sits on. And what happens is if somebody steps on this when it's raised up, that can pop off. So what we'll do now is just get it back into its guide, which is kind of tough with that weather stripping on the one side. But if you just manipulate it a little bit, and get it to kind of sit back in there. And then you simply just want to put those screws back in the holes and tighten it up. Just like that. And then a good thumb or rule, get all these down to where you want it. Close the door, see if there's any gaps that you can see. And then obviously raise it up.